Hey, dude. Want to do stuff? Um, uh, yeah. And welcome back. We're in the Cascade Kingdom. Hi. I'm looking at things. Yeah. Okay. Uh, electricity, airship. Oh, that's right. We didn't make it. Yep. Hit that Bowser fly. Oh, I cannot wait until we get to New Donk City. That was probably one of my favorite ends of the level. No. Ow. So. So, real quick. Yes. Jump, do the ground pound, and then immediately jump. What the fuck? Yep. He gonna hit me. He gonna do it. Yeah, we've already seen. Da. The moon. The moon. So. I do like this scene too, like the little capture. Oh yeah. That's only for like the. That's for, you only get this little scene for the story-driven moons. Mm -hmm. The other ones they just give you. There's like, like you got a moon. And then this thing falls over. And you blow on it. Falls over. It's like he, he's like he got the moon. He got the moon. Run! Multi moon on top of the falls. Yeah, yeah big bitch. Uh -huh. Her fight's really cool too. I like it. It's I've really good mechanic. It. Yeah, it's really neat. Uh, power moon. Yes, it's fine. We need more power moon. Yeah. yeah. We get. We get. Oh, that's really cool. Are you looking for it? Yeah. It's an art thing. It's not an art thing, it's a portal. That will, um... That'll send you to... It'll actually... You have to actually swim in this? Yeah, you actually have to, like, swim up and down. Um, but, uh, yeah, they're, they're little emit portals that'll actually send you to other areas. Oh, really? Yeah, for really? hidden moons. So they're like the old paintings? Yeah. I like the water effect in this game. Mm -hmm. and a lot of games with the old I actually found one in one of the Oh, he's all shiny too, like he's wet. Yeah. yeah. Uh, you'll, in the next, after you finish this, you actually go to a desert area. When you roll around in the sand, you'll actually be sandy when you get out of it. What? Yeah. Um, and you know how in most Mario games, how if you have to deal with like lava or hot stuff, you'll hit it, and you're like, ah, I'm on fire. When you actually get out, you're covered in soot. That's cool. Uh huh. Is it sad that that actually is kind of what happens in Assassin's Creed this time too? Oh really? Yeah. You like, go a little sandy. When you catch on fire, you have soot on you, like you're burnt. Oh wow, that's, that's when actually. When you're in the water, he shakes the water off himself. Not like that. You need four men. Well then, catch it. Quickly, it's a stack. It's a stack of coins. There you go. Got it. Oh uh, yeah. For the most part of the beginning, at this beginning level stuff, it just it's showing you mechanics, so they don't actually show most of the moons yet. But there's a ton of moons in each every world actually. Um, even before you complete the game. I like how it says flip forward instead of just flip. Was, so what? many people used to flip their own. Yeah, and I was just like... Because I was one. And the triple jumps in this game, too. No, I know, I need to. Probably. Mm -hmm. And you can also do the long, the, the long jumps as well. I've been doing it, though. I love the long jumps. Um, you can also... If you jump, ground pound, but before you hit the ground, you press Y, you'll dive. Like, immediately. Maybe? Not looking. Look. A Come on. Everybody's been waiting on that just since the very beginning of the game. I just realized there's a map. Yeah, there's a map. And it points you toward your objective. So yeah, this this 100% expects you to uh, not know, not grab the T-Rex. But, you know. People That'd explore. So yeah, people people explore. They they expect you to be like, oh well I use the uh, I use the um, thing before I'll the chain the chomp before to get through, so I'll just use them again. I want him. You can uh, get him. 
that was this right here was something I thought was super cool. I'm I'm very happy about the idea of what they did there. What happens to the T Rex? They disappear. He goes back to where he was. It's not control like Mario. Yeah. <laughs> I don't. I know Aaron talked about this about the whole red and blue sprite here. About how like oh they never they never go back to like the original colors. And I'm sitting here like because it's an homage, not a, a what you call it a retro thing. Yeah, like if you're not playing the old game, you're playing. Yeah, you're playing a new one. It's just a, like it's just a throwback. It, yeah, it's what not is? that they forgot because there are certain parts in these games. Oh, you may want to go get that moon. Yeah, just hop over, walk around the corner. Okay. Which that was something that threw me off. Was the walking around the corner. I I would I would legitimately play a full game like that. Though. Yeah. Like if you made a 2D Mario game like that, and like you had to use the context of the world to solve puzzles, even kind of like Captain Toad's game. Yeah. Captain Toad's in this game, by the way. It's not. Is it actually Captain Toad in there? Yeah. Even the little Captain Toad that da 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 music that he has. Well then. I just want to see what's happening. Sorry, I'll go back. I don't think it's. But it also, this game also has that thing of, uh, oh, you left the area, everything reset. Kind of thing. I'm fine with that, though. I mean. Hi. So you can actually. It's so mean. You can knock one chain chomp into the other. There's a puzzle. Right there. Not really. Well, later. I think there is later on. Yeah. Well, there's always hidden areas and rooms that you can do stuff in, and there's also, like, sometimes there's time puzzles. Right, right, right. Sorry, I'm getting a little indulgent, but I don't mean to. No, nah, you're fine. Uh, it's a very engrossing game, actually. Oh, I'm just, I'm shocked at how pretty it is. I mean, look at Mm-hmm. Well, I mean, this game launched, and on the day it launched, it already had a 10 out of 10 score. Because it's amazing. Run away from it. Like, this is like an interesting like game mechanic. Now she's gonna try to throw him. Uh, she's gonna her. Uh, the little mustache thing is what always gets me. I think it's so cute. And she's super mad. Yeah. I like how she swipes at it like, dear, I'm gonna get you. It became a face. Okay. Fall down. Yeah. Fall down. And Mario teaching you to beat up women. 1986. <laughs> 84? 86, I think. I think the first Mario game came out in 86. Is it the same year as Zelda? Yeah. So yeah, 86. Yeah. The only reason I know it was 86 is that stupid it struggles. Yeah. I actually have a Mario shirt. Um, it's, Mar it's the Mario logo on it, and it says down since, down since 86. Yeah. I wore it uh, the day Mario Odyssey came out. Very nice. Yeah. Yeah. You got the multi moon. It has the power of three moons. It's still not enough. I like turning a funny angle. I like the ha ha kind of thing. Tis enough. Oh, is it? Yeah. Okay. You only need it to five. How, where did I get the other one? Huh? Where did I get the other one? When you were around the corner. Oh, right, right. I thought only had four. I was like, that's no, not enough. You had five. Well, you, you got one initially. Odyssey, did you just... I don't know why I said, like, yeah, a Japanese is. person. Like, it was a really, like, generic, like, stereotypical Japanese Whoa. way of talking to. I don't know. I don't know. 
Like, like and this has, has probably like. All right, should I move on or should I find some more stuff? Move, uh, on. move on. Moving on. Well, we'll, if we need to come back, we'll come back. But right now, we'll let's move on. Okay. We are we're not completionists. This 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 we're we're story this we're story. Mode. I don't think I could ever complete this game, like full on completion of it. Like, it would just be too much. I think like I would like to. It's just I don't think Plus, this this game has probably like. The, my favorite, like that song, the, the music from this game, like the main song for it, gets in my head so much. Oh, the one that Pauline sings. Yeah. Here we go. Off the rails, all the walls. It's time to raise our sins. I love Stop. it. Stop. Oh. Huh? What? Yeah. It's a captain, Cap. Yeah, he's a. You're you're a captain. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> captain. 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 Like, we'll find out what happens in the same thing next time we do some stuff. Mm -hmm. All right, well, hey, everybody. Thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And thanks for stopping by. And we'll hope to see you in the next Cat Flinging Adventure. A lot of hands, wasn't it? Hands. I should work on that. Probably. I'll try a little bit.